Welcome everybody to Zexpress. Today what I'm going to be doing is to show you how to add a credit card as a payment method inside Shopify. It's going to be a really, really easy step. So what you want to do, of course, is to have your Shopify store already been created. If you don't have a Shopify store, I'm going to leave you the link down below in the description so we can all get started totally for free. And well, now that we are inside Shopify, what you want to do is to go directly into the home section so we can all be on the actual same page. Now, now that we are inside here, what you want to do is to focus the method of the actual settings. Inside settings, let's go and focus for the actual plant. Now here into the plant, you should be seeing here, we have an actual specific plant and you can change the plant in here. We have the billing cycle, the pay yearly and saved 60 years, the payment method. Now here into the payment method, what you can do is to add the actual element of updated. Other solution that I can give you is to go directly here into the billing. Now here, what I wanted to do is to go for add payment method. Inside the add payment method, we are now able to add only PayPal. That means that we are only able to add one credit card at the moment. So if I go here back and I go for the three dots, that means that the actual credit card that was before needed to be changed now. So you need to follow the prompts to configure your credit card payment settings. So this step is going to be established a link between your store and the credit card payment getaway. With the credit card now activated, we can customize the setting to fit your preference. You can set up the currency, enable or disable additional credit cards types, configure any relevant secure settings. So this one is going to be tailored the credit card payment as you're raising to align with your business need. For example, you can add credits if you want to, so you want to not uh, get charges for the actual billing cycles. You can edit, you can even edit or pay yearly if you wanted to. That's totally optional. Once again, the billing currency appears in the usd so that will be actually it guys and lastly just test your credit card transactions before making card changes it's crucial to test your so please test order in your store complete the payment processing using your credit card so this is just to ensure a seamless and secure experience for your customers during the checkout. Usually what everybody does is to go here and to payments, uh, check out the payment provider that they do have available. And what you want to do is to make sure that you are enabling the test mode. So you can see that there's no issue there. And if it is, I think what we can do is to, and what we can do is to solve it. So there's going to be any issue there. So guys, there you have it. Really, really easy process, right? So guys, if you find this guide helpful, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe for more insight, hit the notification bell, thank you for joining us today, remember you have the link down below in the description to get started with Shopify. So guys, with that being said, hopefully we can all see you on a next video.